How's it going everyone? My name is Nuri Plays and welcome to a brand new horror game. I cannot wait. It's been a while since I've even done anything like this on the channel. A new Let's Play series, a walkthrough of a horror game. It's actually been so long. This is Still Wakes of Deep. This is a horror game where you're on an oil rig and I'm pretty sure this is Scottish. So... As always, I'm going to have subtitles enabled for all of you at home because I know Scottish can sound like a bunch of gibberish. Um, but first of all, we got to start the new game, baby. I cannot wait to get into this. Apparently, the game isn't too long. It's going to be like five hours, six hours long. I'm really excited. I'm stoked. Something new for the channel. But let's get right into this bitch. It's been a while since I've actually just played a horror game, like, straight up. Be playing a lot of Tsush Ghosts of Tsushima on the channel. What are you thinking? Going to that place. Wish you hadn't got yourself into this mess, but you did. And you can't run forever. I know you were just trying to do right by me, so I need you to do what's right by us now, please. Cass. I am so tired of fighting. I just want it to be over. I want you home. The girls want you home, but... If you don't deal with this, then we are done for good. I love you. But I won't wait forever. Sus. This is... Girls need you a Christmas card. <laughs> ah, fuck. Merry fucking Christmas. Kaz, Roy's finishing up breakfast if you want something. Uh, I'll, I'll be there in a minute, Trots. Aye, well, didn't wait too long or someone will be off with you. Aye. Yeah, all right. All right, so this is a very interesting start to the game already. Uh, with a letter about our wife being very pissed with us. Uh, yep, so cool. I believe we are playing right now as Kaz, an individual named Kaz. Uh, sorry, girls. There's the Christmas card. I wonder what they were arguing over. All right, but let's go to the... Is it the canteen they wanted us to go to? Damn, this game is like hella detailed though already. So right now we're at 108. Is that correct? 107? Yep, we're right here. Cool. Oh, we could have just examined that like that, but... Okay, so the canteen... Is where? It doesn't really say, does it? Uh, oh no, it just says canteen is downstairs. So if we go downstairs here... Well, hello. All right, Kaz. I'm all right. What are you doing up there? Pipes leaking. If it's not one thing, it's the other. See this old rig? It's a pile of shite. It's falling apart. And we've only just started drilling. Fucking Kadal. And fucking Rennick cutting corners. Aye. Speaking of, you are in the shite, wee man. Rennick got a letter this morning from the mainland and he's been up to a high dough ever since. Heard he's gunning for you. That's just brilliant. Christ, I need a smoke. Can't find my lighter anywhere. Take mine. I don't need it anymore. I got you. You're a fucking lifesaver. I'm going to get breakfast. All right. I'll see you for darts tonight. We'll put a wee picture of Rennick up on the board for you. <laughs> Sounds like a plan. See ya. Oh, there's a naked man in the shower. I'm good. Uh, I'm probably not even going to talk to him right now. He can go wash himself in peace. Um, let's see, there, 106. The canteen was downstairs. Yeah, go down to the canteen. There's some stairs right here. Oh, I can run. Right. All of the signs to the canteen. Where is that now? There we go. How's it going? You all right, Roy? Cars, my old mucker. How do? McClary! 
to my office. That means no, not as soon as you're ready. No. Ah, the sweet sound of Davy Rennick. You think it's the polis? Can't be surprised, Kaz. Have you heard from Suze? She's talking about divorce. Oh, I'm sorry, Kaz. She'll come around. Not if I get the jail, she won't. Well, maybe you could have considered that while you were battering Billy Chamberlain's head in. Cunt slagged off Suze. He had it coming. And there he is. Floats like a butterfly, stings like a bee, and swears like the devil himself. Listen, mate, even if it is the police, maybe it's best to just go back and face it, yeah? Ach, I don't know, Roy. I'm fucking scun up with the whole thing. The Lord loves you, mate, no matter what. And I'm pretty sure Suze does too. That's all clear for you now, Roy. Lovely job, thanks, Dobby. Oh, Trot says he's left your insulin in your cabin. Oh, bless his little communist socks. Muchly appreciated. Ta. Remember, life is like football. It's not over until the final whistle. Aye. You're a Barnsley fan, so you're pretty much fucked from the off, right? Oh, I will see you hand for that McCleary. Now off you trot, lad, before his nibs blows a gasket. <laughs> Okay, so something happened with this guy. He beat up someone that got into an altercation with his wife. How you doing, boys? No bad, Kaz. Raf's here's a bit shaky, though. Gonna be the lad's first solo dive this morning. All right. Ah, you'll be all right, pal. Especially with the big man here looking out for you. Have you done it before? Christ, no. I'll stick to the lecky, thanks. No great in tight spaces, and it's blowing a gale out there. Really filling the lad with confidence there, Kaz. Yeah, sorry, wee man. Don't worry about it. Brody's got you. Brody is a, is a very funny name. Now, who are these people, so... Enjoying your last day, McCleary. What's that supposed to mean? You've been a naughty boy, from what I've heard. Ah, give peace. You're not exactly an angel yourself, I dare. I'll be fine. Well, you'll not be missed. You wouldn't know a day's graft if it slapped you in the face. <laughs> I'd like to see you try and do my job. You wouldn't know a spark plug from a fucking hairdryer. <laughs> <laughs> Watch your mouth, McCleary. There's a very weird, like, dynamic going on at the workplace. I don't know how to feel about that. Yeah, there's also these guys. I don't know who these guys are. Look, there's no escaping. There's going to be a dozen mayor rigs up here by the end of next year because the pricks in Westminster want their grubby wee hands on Scotland's oh, oil. Christ, no this again. The bear is already down to the bare bones. And Cadal are just going to make more cuts to get other rigs on the go. If we don't take industrial action soon, oh, this place... Oh, come on! If we don't take industrial action soon, this place will be even more of a death trap than it already is. He's got a point though, Gibble. We're down to a skeleton crew in the pontoons and it's ropey as fuck down there. Workers of the world unite! What do you think, Kaz? <sighs> I don't know. Just here it affects the lecky. <laughs> what do you think will be keeping the lights on if this place falls apart? That's coal, you numpty! <laughs> <laughs> There's like very good dynamics and there's very negative dynamics happening. Head outside onto the deck. Also, I'm noticing like the sprint is pretty slow for what it is. Are we like overweight or something? I'll leave the area hold. All right, let's go pay that Rennick guy a visit. See what he's all, all about. It's a very interesting game so far. The pacing isn't too slow either, but it's a pretty well paced game. Right, better head up and see what the score is. I'm noticing the game is kind of chopping a little bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change some of the graphic settings uh, right here. Because I am rocking just the highest settings possible. So what I'm gonna do is just go to quality. And that should sort it out. Usually. There you go, it's a lot more smoother. It is a little bit blurrier. But for you people at home, it should be alright still. Unless you're watching this on the, like a 4K TV or something. Am I alright to get by, pal? 
Sorry, you have to go around, Kaz. Bloody bastard. Won't let me through. The art style of the game as well, it doesn't look too realistic, but... One of us needs a heat here, eh? Try not taking mine off next time. Have to miss it, Ennis. Not exactly small. Oh, oh, aye. You're a smart one. Lay it on the deck, eh? Nice and easy. Don't bash it! I was gonna say, it does sound like, uh... No, look. It has, it has a certain loud style to it, kind of like Soma did. And some of the Outlast games. I haven't really played uh, Prey either, but visually, this does look similar to that as well. So down we go. And then let's check this out. Where are we right now? We're under the flare stack somewhere. Something like that. Oh wait, no, that's just you are here. We are under the lower deck. Okay. Let's open that up. Go to the crew lift. Oh, it's right there. I need a hand there, fellas. McCleary. No. I can scale in this hero by myself. <laughs> now we're all right. Cheers, though. Fair enough. You want to transfer here, McCleary? You give me less lip. No. He loves it. McCleary. Office. Office. I don't make me ask again. In a better mood today, is he? You'll be all right, Kaz. You get used to it. We all get a turn. Try not to punch him. <laughs> no promises. Yeah, no promises at all. We're gonna punch his ass into next uh, next year. <laughs> it sounds really annoying already. Same thing on the other side. Uh, can I open that? Steady like. Well done! You're thinking we're 20 year old! Open. They say it's the sea air. Aye, I bet they do! I'll add it to the list! Why can't I open this door? Okay, I guess we don't go this way. My bad. We have to go that way. Give me a minute to check! There's so many people working here, I'm not gonna be able to remember. Ready to love it even more! You're telling him! I told him last time! <laughs> this one's all yours! Yeah, I'm not gonna be too able to remember all these names. That's what I wanted to say. Alright, Roper, what's the problem? Don't usually see you down here. Ah, drills acting up this morning. Got the crew running around like blue-ass flies. But they cannot make head or tail of it. Is that you behind schedule then? Oh, not yet. And uh, not if the gods are smiling on us. So mere fuck than ever. Poor as fucked as you by the sounds of it. Look, you better get up there. The boss man sounds raging. <laughs> well, the boss, when is the boss man never raging? Orders in, but might be two, three weeks before it's shipped like. I can patch it, but we'll need to keep an eye. Maybe say a prayer and all. Okay, the elevator was somewhere... Right here? Is that correct? Stay on the path, mate. A cargo hoist will crush you if you're getting close. <laughs> oh, my bad. Jesus, Scooby. <laughs> Give me a heart attack. Oh, sorry, mate. Can I ask a wee favour? Where do you need, Scoob? Oh, could you do me a quick fix on the crew lift fuse box while you're down there? I need bother. Oh, you're a lifesaver, mate. And don't let the big man get you down, all right? Thanks, pal. The fuse box? <laughs> like this fuse box? You still, you still are, that's not how you solve a problem. You still need another fuse for that. All right, now we go up. Why are you not in my office? Oh, I'm coming, calm your ass. This guy's so stuck up already. Like, bro, I'm going up there. Damn. Look at the scale, the utter scale of this place. <laughs> Looks ridiculous. Okay, your office. Mate, I'm right here. Well, here we fucking go. Enter! Oh no. 
Ah, Mr. McClarney. So glad you could join me and sorry to have got you out of bed. Shut the door and have a seat. Oh, I'm fine, Stan. Sit your ass in that chair, you fucking liability. But I don't... I run a tight ship. Do you understand me? A tight ship. Technically, it's no shit. Shut your gub, you Ned prick! I am sick, sick to fucking bookin' of you wee gobshites messing with my operation. That chef might be a mate of yours, but he does not run things around here. I do. Do you understand me? All right, why don't you just get on with it? Don't you answer me back! You might be the height of shite on shore, McClary, but out here, I am the fucking king. Do you understand me? You bring the polis to my door, to my rig. Uh, I, I can sort this, right? I just need time. Shut it, you clatty gobshite. I've got here some mama who can make a more positive contribution to this operation than you. <laughs> I know Shut you. it! I'm in a meeting. What? Fuck's sake, Gibbo, I don't care. We're on a schedule. It's a fucking drill. You've got a fucking drill, so drill through it. Yeah, well, Roper's a whiny old fud. He's got a problem with everything. I don't care if it feels off. Just fucking do it! Or I'll come down there myself! Is that uh, trouble with the missus? You're fired. You hear me? Fired. Uh, come on, man. Uh, it's only a wee bit of trouble with the polis. I'm good with the lecky. I keep things running. You said it yourself. Out! Get off my rig! Well, that's not very nice. Happy New Year to you too, you cunt. Oh yeah, it is just after Christmas as well. <laughs> Board the helicopter. Interesting. So the helicopter's over there. Well, I'll be damned. Why is the music kicking up? Well, no more running for you guys. It's kind of a shit job anyway, man. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. In the middle of nowhere. In the middle of the ocean, in fact. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Jesus, Gregor! Gregor! Get away Fuck. from the end! Gaz! Gaz! Get back, man! Gaz! Help me! Gaz! Don't let me die, man! Please! I don't wanna die! I think he died too. I think he genuinely died as well. Christ, but you're a right pair. Two bars and a ball bag. Now listen, Pat. I promise I'll take care of him. I had a word with our Kieran, you remember him? He knows Billy Chamberlain from way back. Owes me a favour. Reckons you can sweeten Billy up a bit. Come on. Have I ever let you down? Roy, you lost the cake at the wedding. N now then, now then, that, that wasn't my fault. You left it on a bench at Argyle Street. Aye, you were that bloated you didn't even remember baking the cunt. Oh, my children, that was before the light of the Lord came to me. Here we fucking go. Yeah, and you, Mr. McCleary, you can fuss and cuss all you like. But perhaps if you went to the Saracens a little less and the Tabernacle a little more, then perhaps you'd not be in this pickle, eh? Don't, don't look at me. You're the one who decided to spend the next four months trapped on a rig with this bampot. Susan, I promise you, I promise you, we will get this straightened out. I will. You'd better. Okay, so something really did happen. Guys! Between big old Billy and Kaz. He's got gold! Shit! Guys! Get his legs! We can't leave him out here! Move! Fuck! Kaz! I think he's dead! We've got you, man, alright? We've got you! He's breathing, thank Christ! Kaz, come on. Wake up, Kaz. Why is he not waking up? Can you hear me? Is he going to die, Brody? <laughs> Kaz? <laughs> Get up, bro. Oh, man. 
What a tough start to the game. Okay, well, here we go. Here comes the lucid dream. I know for a fact that this is uh, no longer reality, as far as I'm aware. Guys, I need your help here. What do you mean you need my help? There's something in there. What the hell? McLeary! Thank Christ! You are right being up on your feet? I, my heat's killing me, but... Aye, aye, I think so. You got me out. Did you get Gregor? I got you, aye. I couldn't find Gregor. Fuck. I'm sorry, Cass. Jesus. He's not the only one we lost. No, no, no! Raf's is still in there! Why aren't these working? Cass! I need you to help me! Cass! What? Right, aye, what, what do you need? The cable's stuck. Go down and release the main brake, then come back up and raise the bell. If you can get it to my level, I think I can get him out. Aye! Raf's! It's all right, we're getting you out. We'll be two minutes, pal. Okay, there's the brake. Let's pull that. That's it! Come back and winch up the bell now! Okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. And I'm winching it now. What's going on, Brody? What happened? Don't know. The drill hit something. An air pocket or gas explosion, nobody knows. But whatever it was, it was big. You are lucky, trust me. Douglas is trying to find out Mayor. Like if the bear is even safe now. What's wrong with rafts? I don't know, alright? Decompression shouldn't be this bad. Oh, I shouldn't have let him go down there. I said I'd look after him. I'm here, rafts. It's Brody. I'm gonna get you out. Don't tell me that's not rafts in there. Is there anything man I can do? No, I'll get him. We need to know what's going on up top. You'll need to go through engineering. The way up is blocked from here. Where's engineering for here? I've never been doing this end before. The only way you'll get there is to go under the rig. Should be a clearer path down there. All right, I'll head down now. All right, under rig restricted access. Let's open this bitch up. That's crazy. Oh my god, do not fall. What the hell is this? Uh, can I, I can. Things locked. Whoa. Christ. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, you do not want to go under the rig. Doesn't look very fun. Okay, so we are at leg D. Leg C is access to engineering. So we have to go all the way around, no? Or can I go this way as well? I can probably just go this way. Oh man. Great. Well, that looks like a no-go. Right there as well. Whoa, whoa, what is happening? Yeah, I almost ran into that. What the fuck? Yeah, what is that? What? What? What are you doing? Then you get close to that. Come back and see. What? Cards! Get over here before it falls apart! Find me inside! Is this stuff? Whoa, whoa, whoa! What was, what was that about? Okay. Making my way downtown. Jesus! I almost didn't react in time. That was in intense. What? 
Um, making my way around, don't mind me. Big tentacle thing in the middle of the oil rig. Okay, turn that off. Bring the ladder down. The controls are a bit weird. I'm going to have to get used to them. With the whole mouse button combination. So far, crazy, crazy start to the game. I'm going to end up in the fucking sea again. Okay. Uh, I assume it. Yep. We can't go in there. I have to make the jump. 360. Oh my god. I actually nailed it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stay on that ladder, Jesus Christ. Oh, fucking hell. Just get across. Nah, not a monkey bars, bro. Oh, I hate these. I've always wondered what these were for. Okay, so... Room C should be somewhere over here. Dope. As you can see, it's hella dark in here. What is that? That is what I'm trying to say. Wait, what do you mean skip? Minor drill issue, my ass. This is a temporary drill issue. Drill issue? Jesus Christ. That's more than a drill issue if you ask me. Wait, what do you mean climb? Oh my god, really? Don't look down. I'm looking down. Well, I'm climbing. It looks very dangerous. This whole thing is just falling apart, isn't it? Okay, go across. Shimmy shammy my way. This guy's got the strength of Hercules, but... That's alright. Finally, something useful. A flashlight. Oh no. When a game gives you a flashlight, it's gonna get real spooky. Oh boy. Let me just do that again. Look down there. Oh. Yep. I'm right ahead of you with that one. Press F to use the torch. Making my way through very claustrophobic corridors right now. I'm sure nothing will pop up anytime soon. Oh my god. What is that sound? Hello? Is anyone here? I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see what the hell I'm dealing with. Take your time on screwing that. <laughs> I thought you were gonna just do all four screws. Oh, brother. Oh, 
Jesus. You're headed towards it as well. Hey, what's up? Pick up. There's throwing mechanics. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Excuse me, coming through. Cleary. Guys, over here. Jesus, Finley. You alright? Who are you, you seen a ghost? Who's making that noise? Gibble. He's making that racket. Should we no find him? Help him? No. Oh, I'm gonna recommend that. What Neither that would I. It means he's no alright. After that explosion, he got oil or some shit on him and just. I don't know. He freaked out. Went for me. He's still out there. You mean out here? As in out here with me? Aye, that's exactly what I mean. Oh, that's just fucking brilliant. You seen anyone else? I just go here. Where are you going anyway? Back to accommodation. Listen, you'll have to get through the water tanks to get up to accommodation. And quiet like. Gotta go all the way up there. Jesus. And what about Gibble? Stay the fuck away from me. You're listening to me. It's no right, cuz. I'm no arguing. Cuz! Fucking careful, eh? Hey, you know. Yeah, I mean that sound does not sound very, very nice. Escape through the water tanks. So am I gonna have to sneak by or what? Oh yeah, this is definitely a little bit of a of a precarious situation to be in. Where's the sound? Huh? Huh? Wait. What the fuck? Nice. I can't even know. Why does that effect always come up whenever I'm near that stuff? Is that what I'm gonna turn into? I don't know if, if I want to go up the ladder. I don't think I do. Let's shut that gas valve off. Um, okay, maybe I do. Okay, or maybe we go down here. To turn off the valve. Okay, here we go. That lets us climb up here. And then this lets us shut off the... The blue one at the end. Here we go. I don't know what that first ladder was about. I knew it smelled like sus as hell. That's why I didn't go up it, but... <laughs> Hopefully I didn't miss anything by doing that. Okay, well, let's keep... Actually, you know what? My curiosity is going to get the best of me. Let's go check that out. Because I'm an idiot. Ah. I see. A bunch of blood. Some kind of fuse box or something. It's in the vent above me. Okay, well, there was nothing up here. Boy, am I glad I didn't check that in the first place. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, the game saved here. Is there, is there something up here? Oh, it's a normal day at the office, huh? You are definitely not in the afterlife. And I'm definitely not headed right into where it is. 
Okay, so we are at level three with the water tanks. We need to get to the exit. So I either take the right path, go around there. I could go through the duty officer, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> but we made it to engineering. Oh, man. Okay, yeah, I smell monsters in here. Oh. Uh, yeah, it's too quiet. It's too quiet. So this is where the officer thing should be. That doesn't open. Of course it doesn't open. Can I walk here? Oh, use lockers to hide from what? Leave yet? Don't, don't come in here! <laughs> He's gonna walk by or what, bro? There's got to be somewhere here. Come on. What am I doing? I'm dead. Wait, what do you mean squeeze? Oh. Oops. Yeah, Gimpo's turned into something. Something very unpleasant. Gibbo, should I say, not Gimbo. Is that the exit? Am I out? Am I out of this bitch? Oh, oh run! He's gotta be on my ass. No? No, probably not. Okay. Wow! What a way to introduce the creature. Damn. Can I see him from here? Like, is he actually down there? Did I sneak past him? Yeah, boy, I sure hope I don't see him again. He was right above me. Fuck's sake! Gabo, who the fuck? What did you do? I better stop running, I think. No! Douglas! Move yourself, man. He's dead. Oh, hell nah. So, like, 
He is in here, isn't he? There's so many different ways I could go. I'm just gonna hope this is the right way. Even though there's... Door locked. The simulator. Okay, so I can't go up that way. Jesus. Yeah, I'm good on that. Get me out of there. Jesus Christ. Dude. Accommodation. Let's go, baby. Jesus. God, stop. Shake. Fuck. Stop thinking about it. Just stop thinking about it. Jesus. Jesus. Right. Right. You saw nothing. By the way. That's enough of that. What Is now? Here? Hello? If there's anybody here, fucking say something! McCleary here? Cass, it's O'Connor. I've got Bruce and Fergus with me. You know what's going on? No, but we hit something. You need to get out of there. Don't need to tell me twice. Listen, something's wrong in engineering. It's not safe. We'll go through the leg and come up through the under rig. Rennick, better give the evacuate. O'Connor, you have to go through accommodation. It's all blocked. Do you hear me? O'Connor! Oh, man. People killing, people oh, dying. Christ, that stuff is rank. Let's go to the cantina, maybe there's some food. Some fresh food. Your boy. Uh, what's in here? Stairs that go up. <laughs> Our cantina's blocked off. Stop fast. Okay, well, we go up. And see what is this all about. Canteen's also blocked off again with the weird stuff. What the hell is that? Where are we going? To the lounge. What's happening? Trot. 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 Trot, is that you? I can't hear you, man. Open the door. Trot, the door's blocked. I can't get to you. What's up, wee man? Are you hurt? Jesus Christ. Jesus, Jesus, George, George. What is wrong with this place? What is happening here? Wait a minute, shouldn't that have looped back to the weird tentacle place? Also, where else can I go? Search accommodation for survivors. I can't get this one open. No chance. Okay, so I couldn't have opened that door anyway. Jeez Louise, man. Hopefully someone is at least alive and well in this ocean of horror. Hello? Why is the entire place a mess, though, like? There he is. I see him. It's our boy. Bloody hell, fire! Get in, quick. Thank God you're all right. Jesus, what are you doing in here? What do you think I'm doing in here? What the bloody hell is going on? I don't know. 
People are dying, Roy. Dead? Who? who who's, who's dead? How? Uh, Douglas. Trots, I think. O'Connor, probably. I, I don't know. It's, it's this thing. I, I think it's doing something to people. I don't know what to believe. You know what I mean? I do. I really do. I saw something out on the deck. I, I didn't stay to look. It just scared the shit out of me. I should barricade the door. We can't hide, Roy. We have to get off this rig right the fuck now. Well, without Rennick say so. Roy, did you hear Rennick? What, you think we're getting evacuated? He'd want everybody back at work if we were at the bottom of the North fucking sea. <sighs> right. The lifeboats, then? Aye. You stay. Barricade the door. Let me clear a path, and once we're ready to go, I'll come and get you, right? I'll be here, don't worry. Getting some extra prayers in. <laughs> Aye, we're gonna need them. Gaz, um... You, you won't leave me. It's bloody terrifying out there. I'm not leaving you, pal. I wouldn't blame you if you did, mate. I mean, you've got all the food in here for a start. <laughs> Listen, get your man upstairs on the case, and I'll see you soon, right? Right, off we go. Go downstairs to get lifeboat access. Oh. This looks pretty fun. There's the lifeboats. Oh, man, this is giving off the vibes. Let me tell you what. No, this goes outside. It's too dangerous out there. Yeah, but it's too dangerous, like, right here where you're going anyway. Jeez. Look at that! What the fuck's happened? Is it? Is it looking at me? It's not looking at me, is it? Jesus Christ. Interesting. The fucking thing's locked. What the hell was that? Is that what the afterlife is like? It's just a massive horror game. <laughs> Filled with all sorts of weird shit. I can't open it. <laughs> right, well, in we go. My favorite can of corned beef. That's gonna keep me alive. Shame I can't open doors while I have that in my hand. Oh, hell nah. Where is that can? I need it. Hello? Anybody in here? Stop talking. There's absolutely gonna be something in here. Lifeboat's access, there it is. Well, at least it locked the door. Yeah, I just can't go into any of these doors, damn. My dad's safe, how about you? Yeah, my dad's dead. Probably. But speaking from Kaz's perspective. Oh my good lord. Christ. How am I gonna get down there? It might be me being picky, but I don't like the way the animations are kind of chopping right now. Let me... 
Let me not open that door. I don't want to join him in the afterlife quite yet. Attention crew of the bearer. All personnel need to get to their nearest evacuation point. Don't you all get too excited now. You'll all be back at work in 15 minutes once I get all this nonsense straightened out. Just fucking bastard. He won't get any nonsense straightened out. He'll turn into one of them. Oh, come on. That one looks fine. Probably make it to that one. Oh, this is a long jump. Ooh. Oh, grip, grip, grip. I didn't know I needed to grip that quickly. We go again, boys. We go again. Oh boy, third time's the charm. Let's not do that again. That's exactly what I'm saying, bro. This isn't going to open. I know it's not going to open. There's stuff behind it. Um, drop this thing. Now we go down. Ah, oh, come on, you're joking me. What? Oh, you can get in that, surely. Surely you get in that. Oh yeah, to be fair, you don't want to leave your boy behind. Understandable. I can't get to that door. Oh, thank Christ. Here it is. Okay, how do you prepare the lifeboat? Okay, right. Looks easy enough. Remove the safety pins. Engage the brake lever to swing the boat into boarding position. Embark? Yeah, whatever. So it's one and two. Safety pins and then brake lever. Wherever that is. Okay, these are the safety pins. Halfway out of here. One more. One more. Jesus. Right. Now the lever. Get it into position. Nearly out of this. Where is the lever? Is it like right here? Oh, right here. There is no escape. Oh, that's just broken. Perfect. It just so happens that every single lifeboat is messed up, man. Who's that? Renick. It's me, Kaz. McClary, what the fuck are you doing to my lifeboat? It's gone. It's just fell off into the fucking sea. You must have done it wrong. Fuck off, Rennick. You built this fucking thing, not me. Who's with you? Uh, Roy's in the canteen. Finley and Brody are alive. Listen to me, McClary. Get your ass up to the chopper pad. Bring anyone else you can find to. And whatever you do, don't touch this stuff all over the bearer. I can't, I can't get back out. There's a safety door. The railings are all gone. For God's sake, do I have to tell you how to do everything? Give the door a tidy kick at the bottom. It'll open right enough. What about you? Just concentrate on getting to the pad. Don't worry about me. You see, Rennick? What? Well, does this mean we're okay, like? No hard feelings? Get to fuck, McClary. And when you get back, fuck off again. I'd be happy to see you drown, but I'm not having your death on my fucking record. Go on your cell, yo. Fud. <laughs> Fuck, cheap bastard. That's interesting, then. 
What a toxic workplace, totally. Um, totally shit place to work at. I'm gonna go around this way. I cannot... Uh, actually, yes, there we go. Let's put that out. Really? Come on. Okay, I might as well uh, completely fix that up. In case we ever need to come back here. Probably not going to need that anytime soon. Going to drop it. Uh, let's open this up. Another phone call. Who's that? It's Kaz, Ennis. Kaz. What's going on? Jesus, I, I need help. I, I don't know what to do again. What was that? Christ, something's happening to me. Oh, no. Ennis. Ennis! Fuck. Everyone's dying around you. Jesus. So this game's actually made in Unreal Engine 5. Which explains the bad performance. But boy, does it look good. Uh, so we are supposed to go to a combination. Let's go. I do not like the sound of this. Yeah, that was blocked off for a reason, buddy. Wait, now we're on the same side. Oh, no. As the creature. We're supposed to go back. Back up to Roy. Okay, well. Let's go down and under. Let me just take a peek through the hole. Yeah, I mean. Oh boy. I'm falling. Christ. Don't fucking fall. Don't fucking fall. And I have to go in the same room as that thing? Oh, brother. It is preparing me for one hell of a... ...of a fight. Oh, fuck. Is that... Trots? Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Where is that thing? Of all the times my flashlight is bugging out. Jesus. There's the exit, so all I have to do is pick up that wrench, technically. Bastard. 
run, Kaz, run, 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 run. Jesus Christ, that was close. Oh, I did not want to mess with that thing, whatever that tentacle thing was. All right. Roy. He's blocked the door. The freezer vent. I hope Roy is okay. He is. Okay, sweet. Kaz, you all right? Jesus, you look terrible. Do not go down those fucking stairs. What the hell is going on? Uh, trots. I, I think it was trots. No, it's just fucking horrible, whatever it is. Just stay in here and keep quiet. Did you get to the lifeboats? Yeah. Fuck knows if they ever work, but they definitely don't fucking work now. I had a wee chat with Renick about it while I was out there. How did that go? Badly. The cunt still reckons we should get to the bird. You think? You got a better idea? Kaz, mate, I'm not going to make it over the deck. I'm not feeling so good, pal. I think I need my insulin. What? You're fucking kidding, Roy. Now? Oh, I'm sorry to inconvenience you, Mr. Bloody Fit and Healthy. I'll tell you what, I'll have a little chat with my pancreas, shall I, and tell it to pull its socks off. Right, all right, fuck's sake. Could you not just eat some fucking jam or something? Oh, bloody hell, the man's a medical genius. I'll get on the blower to Dr. fucking Spock and tell him not to panic. We've solved diabetes here. It's fucking McCoy. No Spock. He was the point of year cunt. <laughs> <laughs> you think you can manage to get to your cabin? You've summoned there, aye? Hey? I'll get to the helipad. Make sure that cunt doesn't he try leaving without you. All right. I'm not useless. I can get there. Listen, uh, uh, when, when you get to the chopper, tell Archie to radio in the support ship. We, 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 we need all the fucking help we can get, Kaz. All right, big man, all right. Just be careful, OK? My girls need their godfather in one piece. All right, well, that was a very interesting to start to this series. I think I'm going to end it here uh, for now. If you enjoyed part one, make sure you smash the like button, comment down below, and subscribe. As always, man, this game is something... It's gonna be something special, isn't it? It's like a short and sweet game. Um, that's gonna be the perfect length for a Let's Play series. So, if you guys enjoyed again, smash the like button, comment down below, and subscribe. Besides that, Kaz, Roy, and me. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out.